Thanks for joining me for another Excel tip. This time we are going to talk about how to refresh data in our Excel workbooks. This is applicable for all the workbooks where there are pivot tables involved. And I use pivot tables in many of the templates. And for example, the inventory management templates or the recruitment manager Excel template are just some examples of where pivot tables are involved. When the user adds or updates the input data, the output calculations need to be refreshed. And whenever there are pivot tables involved in the middle, the refresh doesn't happen automatically. You would have to go to the menu and manually refresh the data so that all the calculations in the workbook will now be refreshed to provide you the most updated output. In this video, I will be demonstrating how to do that. So I have the Manufacturing Inventory and Sales Manager Excel template open, and this is what I'm going to use to demonstrate how to refresh the data. And in this case, I have entered no information in the order detail sheet, but there are already information in the other sheets prior to this. So now when we go to the product report sheet, we have some calculations and they are providing certain results. Now, what I'm going to do is to add more data to the order detail sheet and then explain how to refresh the data. So I'm going to use another uh, file where I have pasted some information about order details. So I'm going to just copy from that and I'm going to paste them here, paste special. There you go. It pasted all the information and now I have this. Great. So now when I go to the product report, the information still remains the same. It has not changed. The fields where calculations involve pivot tables, they will not get updated with the new information I have here. So it is very important that we actually go and refresh the data. So in order to do that, I'm gonna to go to product report so that we can see when things change. And I'm going to the data ribbon. I'm hitting the refresh all. And now you can see that the information got updated. So this is where refreshing the data is very, very important. Otherwise, your results might not be reflecting the input data. So once again, go to the data ribbon. And if you are in the home ribbon, you can go to the data ribbon, hit refresh all, and then you will see that the calculations get updated. So it's, this is a very, very easy single step to refresh all the calculations in your entire workbook. If there are any questions about this feature, please leave them in the comments and I will definitely get back to you. Thank you very much for watching the video.